Hello everybody, this is Michael at BigMoneyFishing.com and that is a trash can. If you know me, one of my pet peeves is people who throw trash everywhere. And if we look in this trash can, there's actually some uh, bush light in there. Usually I see that all scattered over the uh, park and thrown on the ground. But today I want to go see how many chicken liver containers we can have. So today, I'm out at Cunningham Lake which is near my house. And I don't normally fish this except from the bank. You know, I mainly fish the river. You know, we have our sign that tells you you can't keep northern pike and all bass of all species have to be 21 inches or over. But today we're going to see how many chicken liver containers we can see thrown on the ground. And my goal is to get people to stop throwing their chicken liver containers on the ground. So let's walk down to the dam. A very, a very uh, popular place for people to fish because they can park their cars right up there. All right. You know, it's a real rainy day. And um, hopefully the wind noise won't be too bad. And hopefully the screen won't get too wet. My umbrella wasn't working, but a little rain's not going to hurt me. So let's go see what we can find. And I implore you. Pick up your chicken livers, please. Pick up your chicken liver containers, please. They're not that heavy. Here we go. Now this is Cunningham Lake Dam Side 11. Let's see how many chicken liver containers we can find. I'm going to walk down here. Hopefully I won't stumble too much as I come down here. All right. All right, let's see. So far, so far things seem pretty clean. Well, there's our first worm container. Just left here, you know, because this thing weighs. It's so hard to get this thing out here. I'll pick it up. But, you know, someone just decided, I'm just going to throw my worm container down. Okay. Of course, we have our obligatory, it looks like a soda bottle, 20 ounce soda bottle. We have our cans. Gotta have your cans. Gotta throw those on the ground. You know, because it's so hard to flatten that, then pick it up. Looks like the Coors Light. But what we're really looking for is chicken liver containers. This is a lake. Anybody interested? Of course, you got to throw your. Uh, I'm not really sure what that is. I'm not gonna. I'll pick that up later. Um, not a lot of chicken liver containers. Well, uh, here we do have a. We got a small catfish there that looks like someone probably gut hooked and it died. That happens. I'm not. You know that happens. Here, someone just threw down whole bag of trash and I will carry that out when I leave. I'm not even sure what's in there. Looks like a bunch of cans. Well, it was a half attempt to clean up. Or maybe someone left it here so other people will pick their stuff up. I don't know. That's probably why I'm not seeing any chicken living pinners. Someone was nice and did all that work for me. Alright. Very surprised. I'm glad I don't see a lot of chicken liver containers yet. Let's see. Well, like somebody had a little party here. They've got their their 
cola. You know when it says cola, you know it's cheap. More stuff, just more trash. More trash. More trash. And guys, I'm I'll pick some of this up, but I can't pick up everything. Now, someone threw their peanut butter chocolate chip cookie bag on the ground. Just like, hey, I'm just lazy, I'll just throw it there. Of course. There are more bottles. Some sort of liquor. I'm not sure what that is. Um, here we go. <clears throat> All right, so there is our first, or our second, our worm container. Because this thing is just so, so hard to get, you know, carry that out. So I'll throw it down next to my Corona bottle. Here, I'll pick that up. We'll take that out. Here's our here's a, a Diet Coke can. Another Corona bottle. And keep in mind, these Corona bottles didn't blow here. They're too heavy to blow. So, someone just threw that on the ground and said, screw it. You know? There's some other trash up there someone just threw on the ground. Old rusty can, someone get cut and need a tetanus shot. Here's another bottle, some sort. Looks like Squirt, I haven't had one of those. And here's, here's just more trash. Somebody threw their cracker ham crunchies down on the ground. Cracker crunchies, ham, whatever that is, I don't know. I don't eat that type of stuff. Armor. And we found what we were fishing for. The obligatory Tyson all-natural chicken livers. I'm done with it. And I'm done fishing. I'll just throw my stuff on the ground. Who cares? I'll pick that up. Here we have another worm container. More trash. Just more trash and more trash. Guys, just pick your trash up. It's not that hard. You brought it down here, pick it up. It looks like someone just had a party here. Trash, trash, articles of clothing. Um, looks like a bunch of gloves. I don't know if someone was having a meth lab here. Or they were really concerned about uh, touching bait or fish or something. Look, we got some sort of bait. I'm not even going to touch any of this. I'll have to go get gloves and pick all this up. Somebody actually had an illegal fire on the dam. They left their cheesy bread. They left their marble menthols. Uh, a dead carp thrown up on the bank right there. Um, Pepsi can. Some Munchables. They even left their off bottle. And I assume that's a can of corn. Liquor bottles. If I can get that. Liquor bottle. It goes on and on and on. This this is just, this is just disgusting. Like someone had a bag of corn there. Uh, some other sort of bottle. Um, something from Cubbies. I'm sure Cubbies doesn't appreciate you throwing their stuff on the ground. Um, some type of uh, Gatorade more uh, cans bottle in the water this is a this is a public park guys and people just say hey I'm just gonna throw my junk everywhere so I don't care I'm a jerk someone else pick it up bigmoneyfishing.com will pick it up let him worry about it okay so oh from my youth Colt 45 malt liquor um, is that the one with the bull? I'm not sure. What was the one with uh, Billy D. Williams with the bull? That was something else. Anyway, there's your Colt 45. There is your um, worm container. Big reds. Let me just throw the top down on the ground. I, I know it weighs so much. It's so heavy to me. How could I ever take it up to that green trash can? So, you know, just... This is beyond ridiculous. This is just... 
hell. Here we have more trash can. I don't know what that is. Some sort of Red Bull or something. Um, Walmart, great value, distilled water. I'll just throw that on the ground. Just throw my scooters thing on the ground. I'll just throw my Mountain Dew Red on the ground. I think I believe that is. Oh, my favorite. Just throw a bunch of fishing line on the ground and they get all tangled up because that's so hard to put in my back pocket. More containers, trash, something from Hy-Vee, uh, Starbucks, coffee thing, just trash, trash. This is a public park, y'all. Worm container lid. Um, well, at least the lake is beautiful. I wonder how much trash is in it. I'm about halfway down the uh, the dam there. It would probably be smart if they put some trash cans up here. Maybe that might help. Oh, the trash can is way up there, but that's no excuse. Either way. So I'm walking. Let's see. More trash. More trash. Um, it's just everywhere. I'm going to try to go up a little bit. Speed up this video. So I'm walking, so now I'm kind of walking down the trail a little bit, and we'll get some pictures up. All right, there's a there's a bobber down there, I believe. If I can get to it. Now that may have just drifted here. This bobber right there. We'll just see. I know this is probably a boring video, but I just want to make... So well, that's a perfectly good bobber. So, you know, my kids like fishing with bobbers. I'll keep that. Here's, um... I assume this is a... Looks like there's a chicken on there. So that's a chicken liver thing. I'll pick that up. Here's a... Looks like a bluegill, or... Could have been a green sunfish. Probably a bluegill. I can't tell because it's decomposed. Just more trash, and more trash, and more trash, and more trash. All right. So, people just, please pick your trash up, you know. Just, please pick your trash up, and if you're out here, pick other people's trash up, too. I can't do it all, and other people can't do it. There's a gallon uh, milk jug right there. Let's see. So only two chicken liver containers so far, but you see other trash. There's a lot of trash down there. Let's get a beautiful picture of the lake, give you something to be happy about. It's a nice house up there on the hill up there. If I can get it. Nice house up there on the hill. Alright. More trash. I think I see another bobber. someone's bobber there I'll take that thank you if it works I'll pick it up either way my kids like fishing with bobbers never have enough bobbers when you're fishing with kids hopefully I don't fall and trip as I go down to get it it's right on the water there. let's see here yeah perfectly good bobber that's going in my back pocket you know more trash more trash people just do it down See what kind of a container this is. Ah, look what we got here. Heritage chicken livers. I'll just throw this on the ground. I can't take it back to the green can. It weighs so much. I'm so tired from not catching fish. And I'll pick that up. Here's some, I think this is someone's Subway uh, sandwich bag or wrapper. Here's a shoe. Someone was even nice enough to leave us a Corona almost full. I never really liked Corona. So, you know, I'll pour this out and clean this up. What more can I do? That is beer. So, there it is. We'll put that in our bag. Some more bobbers. I'm not even going to bother. Those look kind of 
That one's kind of old and disgusting. I don't want to put that in my back pocket. There's another bobber. More water bottles and of course this video just goes on and on and on and on and on. Here's another water bottle. But I think we found what we were looking for. I think this is number four. Good old chicken livers. Yep. All natural chicken livers. Because it was so tough to throw this in the garbage can. Yep. So, you know, please don't do that. I'll pick that up. No, I'll, don't worry, I'll do it for you. Some Bud Light cans. I'm about, I don't know, three-fourths of the way down. Here we have some... Those are Canadian night crawlers from, you know, like the ones from Walmart, but I think they sell them everywhere, though. Um, you know... Someone even threw a ribbon down here. I guess they were unwrapping their chicken livers of some sort. And on and on and on and on. At least I get some exercise from this. But my goal is to get to show people how disgusting everyone is. Some more trash. And I guess I should get a let's get a view of the marina if I can. There's the boat's docked over there. If I launch my boat, I launch my boat right over there. Right over there. And I won't I won't even talk about the people who swim when they're not supposed to be swimming. Um, and I used to hate this lake when I was a kid, but they've actually drained it and restored it. It's better for it. Except for the idiots who throw their trash everywhere. Trash, trash. More bobbers, styrofoam cap of some sort, camels. You know, three out of four doctors prefer camels. Coke can, um, laser sharp hooks, more bobbers. But well, I'm not better buying bobbers again if I can just come here and pick them up. Some sort of container. Uh, what do you call that? Skull or chew can. Modelo. On and on and on and on. And here we hit the we hit the trifecta. We got the chicken liver container. All natural chicken livers. We have the worm container. Let me wipe my uh, wipe the screen. We have the worm container. And like I said before, the chicken liver container and some sort of alcohol. That's the trifecta there. So what is that? Number five of the chicken liver containers. Um, of course, we have another shoe. Seems to be Nike or some sort. Yeah. I don't know if that was littered, but someone obviously lost their shoe. And on and on and on. I'm basically getting to the end of the dam. So I'm going to start going up. So people, not the most interesting video. And there's a lake that's really close to my house. I could probably get here in five minutes. Not a car. There's some big bass in this lake. Not great numbers, but... I've, I've caught a couple 21-inch bass here, and I've seen pictures of other people caught 21-inch basses. Um, nice lake. And that back end back there is a lot of carp back there, but that's not our point. So anyway, we're on the end of the dam, and we've proven that people are slobs and don't pick up their stuff. So this is Michael at Big Muddy Fishing. I know this isn't the most exciting video, but please share this video. Please subscribe. You know, my goal is to educate people about the mess that people send out. So please check me out, bigmuddyfishing.com.